when I injured my ankle freshman year of football in high school. Uh, I was the week right before the first game, so uh, it was frustrating seeing the rest of my classmates getting to win the games as a team and me being on the sideline. If you can communicate with the athlete that, hey, I've been in your shoes, I get what you're saying, I get that the game's important, but my goal is to get you through the rest of the season or through the rest of your career or, you know, at some point everyone has to stop playing sports and, and have a career in something else and making sure you're healthy for that life, it seems to, to relate to most athletes definitely refer to me for any kind of muscle skeletal injury, whether it's athletics or just kind of your everyday person that has any kind of joint pain or, or muscle injury. The other big thing I do is concussion management, a credentialed impact consultant. It's a neurocognitive test on the computer that most major league sports in the U.S. use. And so it's just a, another tool that we can help guide us in managing concussions and getting the kids back to the field safely. There's been a handful of athletes that I've seen that didn't think they'd be able to participate anymore, especially with the more serious knee injuries. Um, you know, back 20 years ago, some of these knee injuries would have been career-ending injuries, and now kids are able to compete at their level back within a year. That's one of the reasons why I like to cover the, the events, too, on the sideline, whether it's for the high school football games or for Washburn University, uh, seeing the kids that have gone through all the rehab process and seeing me in clinic for follow-ups. They get really happy that they get to be back to where they thought they couldn't be before.